golly gee willikers. Should I call her? Oh, horseradishes. I just don't know what to do. Yo, my man, Mortimer, do me a favor, son. Slide off your granny panties, grow some damn jungle hair under your armpits, man up, and call this female. Scatter thought? What are you doing here? I'm trying to help you get your groove started, you freaking dweebazoid. Okay, I'll call her. Just show me how you did that first. Alright, I got you, my dude. Let's get into it. Alright, I'm gonna need a few things to get this done. I'm gonna need a tripod and a green screen. And of course, I'm gonna need some studio lights. That's about it. What you're gonna do is you're going to take your phone, you're gonna record it in uh, one position. You probably want to get your camera at a little flatter angle so that your hologram seems to stand out a little bit more. And then you got to record your subject with the green screen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the phone and I'm going to drop it into the timeline, the bottom track. And I'm going to take the green screen and I'm going to drop it, the green screen subject and drop it right above that. I'm going to go to a position on here where I can see both. I'm going to right click on the clip with the green screen and the subject. I'm going to go to open effects editor. I'm going to start off by going to the 2D, 3D. I'm going to go to the crop. And I want to see everything, so I'm going to change it to see the things below it. I'm going to go ahead and crop out the pieces that I don't want. That looks good. So now I'm going to go to camera. And I'm going to go to pan and zoom. Matter of fact, let's go to keyers first and let's go to the chroma key. And we'll just apply the chroma key to that. We'll leave it as is for now. Now we'll go to camera and we'll go to pan and zoom. And make sure we turn off any keyframes on that. And we'll zoom in, zoom out to size the subject up to where we want them. And then we'll move the subject into position. Where we want the subject to show on the phone. Let me make it a little bit bigger than that. Alright. So now I'm going to go back to camera and I'm going to go add a radio blur, which kind of makes the subject look a little, you know, blurred out like he's a actual hologram. If you want to, you can go to camera and you can go ahead and add noise as well that adds a little bit more noise to it like as it plays so it makes it look like the person is actually a hologram now when you're done with that you want to go to add-ons and you want to go to shine so we're going to use the default for HD shimmer enlightenment we're going to go to controls we're going to change the ray length to 1 and shimmer we're going to change that phase to 10 boost light we're going to leave that at 1 and we're going to change the base to alpha and then we're going to go to controls and we're going to change the transfer mode to overlay other thing that we want to do is we want to go ahead and change the source opacity so we can kind of see through them but you know what we'll do we'll leave the source opacity there and we'll go back to the chroma key here and we'll do the opacity or transparency here to make our subject a little bit more transparent so we can see some of the foam through them so it actually looks like a hologram there you go mortimer now it's your turn son call that female Okay, I'm going to call Griselda right now. Griselda? Yo, my man, change your plans. Take your phone, throw it in a wood chipper, and cut your hands off. Just in case you ever think about calling that girl again, I'm out.